All right, that's a fantastic performance. Don't forget, you buy this guitar right here on Norm's Rares Guitar this Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. What the hell? It's music reaction time. Ah, yeah. Hello, all our Swedish fans. Hi. It is Chris Clever time again. That's right. We've been reacting to him now for the last couple of weeks, ever since we saw him America's Got Talent. And we will continue to sing praises for him yes. so that he can make it all the way to the finals. That's right. So, with another recommendation from you all. This one from Norm's Rare Guitar. Hmm. Yeah, I know. It sounds like a website that pitches a guitar shop. My guess is Chris went and performed here uh -huh. and just to play a 1947 Gibson, a classic guitar. Wow. And so this is going to be him performing live in the guitar shop. What? I know. All I know is if Chris was a superhero, his guitar would be his superpower. <laughs> Really? Yes. It electrify you? Him and that guitar is just like symbiotic. He's an amazing singer without the guitar. Don't get me wrong. Absolutely. But he looks like he's a lot more comfortable with it. Looks like this video has been discovered because it has over 400,000 views. Probably because ever since Chris has been on America's Got Talent, a lot of his past videos have just exploded. Mm. And, you know, people like us have discovered it and quite frankly start to really appreciate just about everything from Sweden these days. So <laughs> let's check this out. Let's do it. All right. And away we go. Hey, everybody. Norm over here. And I've got my friend Chris Cleffard. Yeah. And Chris is from Sweden. And he won Swedish Idol. And just for you Americans, it's not Swedish American Idol. It's <laughs> Swedish Idol. Swedish Idol. I just want to put that correction in there. And this guy can really play and really sing. He's really great. And, and, you know, it's amazing how players from all over the world really have assimilated into pop music and, you know, just do it so well. His voice is so great, and he plays very authentic. It's kind of almost Americana, even though you're from Sweden, yeah, yeah. you know. So, and one of your favorites is? One of my favorites is Chris Stapleton. He's like my, my oh, my God, he's my God. Oh, yes. Chris who? Yes, now that he says it. Chris Stapleton is like a uh, country music star. Very similar so in style why, yeah. to his voice and his type of music that he plays. Ah. Oh, my God. Those two need to do a collab for sure. Chris is uh, an amazing singer, songwriter, guitarist. Uh, yeah. He's the real deal. Kind of combines country, rhythm and blues yeah, yeah. and all kinds of Americana. Um, why don't you play a little bit for us? Just yeah, show of people course. kind of what you do. I put that record on. Girl, you know what song. And I'll let it play again and again. You're He's got the reserve growl going on. He uses it just right in the right places, too. I know this song. Maybe I, song. I can play this. I know the Simple chords. chords. Oh man, you're driving me mad, Chris. What are you listening to? Is it a common band? Some kind of stomp always not on us. Nay, guitars, or is it? Something 
One, I feel like he's serenading me on this one. It's so intimate. Like they're so lucky, whoever's in that room. About Got a little great. bit of a small really audience impressed. there too. And I'll tell you, this guy won Swedish Idol. If some guy comes in from Czechoslovakia and says, <laughs> I won Czechoslovakia Idol, and he plays and sounds like that, I'm going to go do a high dive off of a building. <laughs> this guy is unbelievable. It's, uh, it's really it doesn't make any sense. People from different countries playing this type of music so well and so authentically. Thank you. Very soulful, great voice, very tasteful. Yeah. You can take the guitar Chris Leffard, home. everybody. Thank you. Sweetest Don't out, Chris. Right here I wonder how much that guitar costs. I'm very fortunate to have it. Because it's not something you could just regularly go buy. I mean, it's almost like aged wine. You know what I'm saying? It's like, uh, it's it's a rarity. Uh, so you have to go and find it. I mean, anything from like the 40s is a rarity today if you can find right, something in that right. kind of condition. I don't know if guitars are like wine where the older they get, the better they sound. Not sure. <laughs> I feel like he's serenading it to me. This it's not one. really a love song, baby. <laughs> okay, I don't care. <laughs> well, we're watching him on YouTube, which is sort of like peering in through the window of the store while he's playing. It's really close. No. It's close enough. <laughs> close enough. You weren't invited to the party, but you're still peeking in like a window <laughs> okay, shopper. Okay, okay. You know what's really going to be tragic about performances what? like this? Mm. This will probably be one of the last times that we'll hear people talk about and sing about what did you listen to on the radio? This younger generation is just going to talk about what did I stream from YouTube or what did I listen to on Spotify? Oh, that's right. No more radio. What's your playlist on Pandora? You know, it just don't sound as good. This Norman guy, I tell you, let me, let's check out his website because he's got a couple hundred yeah, thousand yeah. subscribers now. Exactly. So he must be Rare guitars. inviting a bunch of people in to perform. Like, I wonder if he paid Chris to be there to perform. How did Chris just wound up? Let's see, where is his shop here? Tarzana. Tarzana. I used to live California. in Tarzana. It's in uh, the valley up in Los Angeles. In fact, I actually had a, a condo there before. Oh. Exactly in Tarzana. Really? Oh, I can't believe I've never been to this shop. But look, he's got a bunch of artists performing. Oh, this video has 400,000 views, so clearly already one of the most popular videos, videos. that he has. Yeah. Of course, I think it helps with the fact that he's on America's Got Talent. So, That's boom. Right. That's like free advertising. Mm -hmm. This guy, Norman, took the right gamble. That's right. He's smart. He's smart. Smart, Norman. <laughs> Before Chris gets really, really famous, now mm -hmm. we still have some time to go and stop at his shop exactly. and play. The fact that you got people recommending this video to listen to Chris perform, and boom, now we're checking out his store. And look at us, we're doing reactions. We're giving him free advertising too. This will be another 100,000 free views for Chris <laughs> and Norman. Oh Norman, I'm hoping I get some residual, you know, a percentage of, you know, you know, you know. This is, this is a brilliant wow. idea. Wow. Why did I think about this? But is that like he's selling the guitar or like he's collecting all those? The shop. So you could tell that he's selling them. Uh -huh. So what he's doing, he's getting these great guitars, great singers to come in and perform. And if he was a little more used car salesman, after every performance, you'd go, all right, that's a fantastic performance. Don't forget, you buy this guitar right here on Norm's Rares Guitar down in Tarzana this Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> that's what a used car the salesman old school, does. old school um, commercial. That's right, like, the old school commercial. <laughs> being annoying. No, no, this is new school. You do it on YouTube and you're subtle about it. Oh, anyway, it's fantastic did, did performance. Great. I love wow. it. <laughs>